over time, the course, I think, has developed a really strong reputation in the marketplace with, with visual effects vendors in Australia and globally as a place where if people have come through our course because of the practical aspects of what we do, those artists are now ready to sit down and do work pretty much straight away. So instead of having a long lead time to getting people work ready, they walk out of our course in a work ready state where they can walk into a facility and deliver actual shots. Initially we started to run these courses to, to bridge the gap between uh, traditional education and employability and uh, success has grown from these courses and we've ended up with students coming to us and, and ending up both working here at Rising Sun Pictures, um, being employed interstate and, and globally as well. What we've started to see over the last couple of years is that being a digital artist is more and more a recognised career for young people. And if you're technologically inclined and artistically inclined, and plenty of people are, I think there's now an awareness that this is actually a really viable and valuable and interesting career pathway to take because it also sets you up for a lot of future forms of media with virtual reality, gaming, interactive media and these kinds of things where the skills that you learn in doing digital effects and animation, they're portable skills that take you into a lot of pathways that haven't even really opened up yet. Learning is also quite immersive in the way that students are um, you know, walking through the building. They're actually seeing artists work every day on movies that you know, will come out in a few months time or a year's time. Our instructors are production artists. They've, they're actually working on the floor, they're working on movies and they're also teaching in class too. 11 months or 12 months after finishing my studies at Rising Sun Pictures, I'm, I'm back here as a staff member. And when I look around the floor, I, I have co-workers here who were co-students. Um, there are even some co-workers who were actually my students from a few months ago, which is quite interesting. And it's really nice to have these friendly faces around that I used to study with in this facility. And now I work with them in this facility. I did the um, third year industry placement here at, at Rising Sun, which just even, even that step up from what I'd learned and what I was doing and my base knowledge from anywhere else to here was just ridiculous. And then now that I'm in and doing the graduate certificate, it's another bump up. You know, there are, there are higher expectations, but we're given the tools and the resources and we have the knowledge to meet them. So the students have the opportunity to work on a real short film from an external client and they fill different roles. Uh, you'll have students that want to be focusing on compositing so they will do comp shots for the film. Um, some students will want to do lighting and they will light anything required in the movie. They have to meet those client briefs and deadlines and they're, they're fulfilling those roles and working towards a concise unified end goal as a team and that sort of practical experience isn't something that you really get anywhere else. The student short film experience has launched a lot of uh, graduates into fantastic employment opportunities. It just, it, it really puts them in, in a situation where they're learning and they're actually making things and making something that they can be proud of. Uh, I've worked in education for about 20 years and I think just, you know, seeing that outcome and seeing a student so proud of their work and then that turn into paid work, hey, there's nothing better than that. <laughs>